It was anyway. Let's play showdown. Jesus fucking Christ. Let's play Pokemon Showdown with Toby. Ha <laughs> ha. The fuck? Gonna have to delete that. Showdown and stream. Cha cha cha. God damn. God damn. Excellent. I also actually need to hold on. Give me one second here. <laughs> I need to turn off the switch. Let me do that at the same time. Damn, you got a star me? Shit. Alright, alright, alright. Let me see what's going on here. All right, so I got a Garchomp. Well, I can't, I can't be doing that. God, Starmie's so annoying. <laughs> Starmie's so fucking annoying. Uh, I got Ice Beam, Thunderbolt. They can have everything. I literally like don't have anything to fight this fucking thing. I guess I'm supposed to do this. Okay, okay, okay. Toby's been playing a lot, apparently. I haven't played since whenever I last played on stream, so. I'm gonna play it safe and crunch. Nice. So, what do I got here? If he earthquakes, that'll do a lot to me. Do I have anything that's good against earthquake? Kind of, but then he's still faster. Am I faster than him though? I am, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm fast. Nice. At first, I was trying to think about switch them, and then I was like, "Wait a second! I have earthquake, and I'm faster." She, let's go. All right, we can change the size into these things, though. I don't need to see that. I can just make myself a little bigger. Boom, bam. Torkel, huh? I don't want you getting up no rocks. Oh, he just exploded. Okay, well. All right. In that case, I think I do this. Aganium. Huh. Yeah, it's just not worth it, right? I just do this. Or this. Let's see, probably this. Okay. Well, I still have to switch. <laughs> so that's that's a thing. Uh wow, he has fucking Kyogre. Okay, well Does he have Ice Beam? Oh I guess we don't know yet. Okay. Sure. I think he's probably gonna put up a screen or something, right? screen Yeah, 
Yeah, the problem with this is that he probably can still just one-shot me with an ice beam. Okay, okay, maybe not. Frozen? Bro. Frozen? You gonna freeze me there? You gonna freeze me there? <sighs> All right, I could do this move. It's gonna be neutral at least on everything. Obviously, Meganium's the biggest, but at least I'll get something. Light screen's gone. Energy ball? That's crazy. Okay, okay. Boom. I'm okay with that. Not gonna make the read twice. Hasn't surfed yet. Question is, do I go for Rally? Gator. Can't really go Tangrowth. I kind of want to save the Jinx. Even though, really, the Jinx isn't even that good against anything except for the Meganium. Which is interesting. I mean, Focus Blast is fine against, these, against Kyogre and Pachirisu, I guess. And Ice Beam's fine against Pachirisu, but... happen so light screens coming in so then what light screen so I should just return okay decent chance he switches now There's the screen. Now I sleep powder. Oh my god. Double sleep powder miss! So awesome. I love missing sleep powder all the time. I love missing sleep powder all the time. Okay, so. He's either gonna immediately switch or I guess Jinx isn't that bad either way. I would assume he's gonna immediately switch. Probably to one of these two. We don't actually know what Kyogre has. We know it has lefties, but we don't know if it's Calm Mind Surf or if it has, you know, we don't know if it's Rest Talk. We don't really need Magmortar in order to win. I don't think. But it isn't faster than either of those. Um, just went for it. Let's go. Let's go. Big read, big read. All right, uh, probably shouldn't bother with this anymore, right? Probably just make sure he does it. That's fine. You know he has Ice Beam. That's gone. You do this. He is faster, so if he has Thunder, that's bad. If he has Thunder, that's bad. I am faster this way, and I could Thunderbolt. I could potentially substitute in case he switches? Let's see. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Yep, we knew that's coming. We knew that's coming. So now...
now we can do this, I think, and return. He's faster. He's faster. Oh my god, that was so bad. Okay, I'm faster this way. Yeah, that, that was... I literally had said he's already faster earlier, and I still just, like, didn't do it. Um... Do I think Earthquake can kill? Do I think Earthquake can kill? Um... We'll find out. Okay. Alright, we got a match. We got a match. Can I just Earthquake again? I think we got this one. I think Jinx will be able to wrap it up. The the power slap on Starmie was the big the big game changer. Hasn't been asleep any turns yet, so probably best to just go straight into Jinx. And then substitute. Ice beam. And that's game. You know what? I missed two sleep powders, but I, but I, you know, getting that one sleep finally. Oof. Type battle, type battle. Type battle against Toby. Gold Duck and Electivire. I'm just gonna do the smart thing and the level one thing and just do that. Ouch. Let's go. Flamethrower? Okay. I tried. <laughs> I tried to move. <laughs> the other move wouldn't have been good either, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's think. For Giratina, it's either like Ghost, Ice, or Dragon, right? Or Dark, I guess. <sighs> Usually, they calm mind up a bunch and whatnot. This would probably be all right. Don't really like that. Not a huge fan of that. Yeah, I think either Snorlax or I think I like Snorlax option here. Cause I can dodge a, dodge some moves too. He'll have to use the dragon move on me. I have pretty decent special. Stab crunch, choice band. Wow, really? That's a little surprising to me. I mean, I'm gonna kill him before he dies. He might sleep here, though? No, he's just... Oh, he went for the crit! He went for the crit! And I can't do this and then try and sucker punch. That's a problem. That is a problem. Am I faster? I'm faster, but I have to hope that I kill with a 1.5. Not a good look. That is not a good look. Yeah, rest. No, he just does it himself. Okay. Okay, okay. In case he switches. In case he switches, I'm a genius. In case he switches, I'm a genius. If he had a Pokemon with Pursuit here, this would 100% be the time to bring it in. 100% be the time to bring it in. Because I'm already low enough that if I don't switch and don't kill, the Pursuit probably going to kill. And then if I switch, obviously he gets the kill there too. But, kind of random weather. You know, it is random, so no reason to expect that. And even even back in the day when you had your own teams, it wasn't like, uh, it wasn't like every team had someone with Pursuit. I feel like it wasn't something you saw that often. Leafy on, huh? Well, what do we want? What would we rather do? I guess I would rather do Mothim because it can heal itself, and then also because I don't have much physical left. Double resist as well. So I think I just air slash. Well, let's see. I guess, yeah, air slash. 
Nice. No idea if the crit mattered or not. I honestly don't know. Uh, he is faster, huh? I guess I could Gore Abyss. I don't know if that's necessary, but... This has Swift Swim, right? No, it has Damp and Cloud Nine. Cloud Nine does something about the rain, doesn't it? It, like, gets rid of it. Let's go here. Spikes, huh? This is kind of... I probably should have went to Electivire, to be honest, but... Yeah, you know what? That was dumb. <laughs> that was dumb. Damn. Is he gonna do third layer? No, he's gonna explode. Of course he is. It's the right thing to do. Um, let's see. Golduck is faster than me? No. This is faster than me? No. I think just about anything that's... Everything is faster except... Well, the Viper's not. And neither is Motham. Um... I guess Motham would dodge... The spikes. But it's not really good against anything else anyway. I guess i do this then. Yeah. Okay. Let it, uh... Let it kill me. No reason to no reason to change that. This is a 182 speed. Flamethrower obviously good there. It's a Viper, not really, so I guess Electivire. But the rain's out, so that's gonna weaken the the way the rain is out, so that's gonna weaken the uh, flamethrower. Hmm. So now I am kind of tempted to go to Viper, and then Aqua Tail? Question mark. I don't think I don't want to be sucker punching because that technically he could have uh, technically could have the toxic spikes and then like dodge that way and then I guess I could earthquake right because B drill is uh, but that, that actually doesn't matter because bug right yeah not flying it's bug poison. I would assume Aqua Tail does more because of the rain boost. Nice. So then maybe Goldbuck comes in and I Sucker Punch. Nice. And then Beedrill will come in and it can kill me if it wants. I will just Earthquake. And then I will Earthquake again. I'll Sucker Punch now. Easy. Nice. I definitely got a lucky crit, I'm pretty sure, with the Leafy on, though. I don't think that would have one shot. Oh, God. Okay. Um, uh, Jesus. Uh, I am faster? No, we tie. I should just return. I shouldn't mess around. Okay. You don't want to mess around with a line, you know? All right. That is unfortunate. He's going to get rocks up. And I have a bird thing. So let's think about this. What do I have here? Tropius sucks against that. Um, a Breloom. It's Focus Punch variant. Focus Punch no sub? I hate this Breloom set. I hate any Breloom set that is Focus Punch but doesn't have substitute. It's like, what are you trying to pull? What are you trying to pull right now? You know? It's not gonna happen. And I don't have Rapid Spin. Trying to think. I guess I could Vigoroth Encore Stealth Rocks. He's probably just gonna switch out anyway, though. And then what? I don't do anything. I low kick, I guess. Damn, my Steelix doesn't even have his rocks, so it doesn't even matter either. Um. There's the rocks. Yeah, there's that. All I, all I would have done was low kick anyway, so it doesn't really change too much. Um, Night Slash will still be good. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to think. Usually they don't run anything that would be too crazy here. They would just sort of, you know, either Nasty Plot or uh, just Calm Mind or 
you know, one of those types of things. Night Slashes still do a good amount. Um, I do have two grass types, but... Yeah, maybe that was not worth it. Thunder Wave? I did not expect Thunder Wave. Yeah, that sucks. That sucks. That sucks. Okay. What do we think about that? What do we think about that? I'm so useless now because I'm slow and I don't even have speed up moves, so I'm just gonna... All right, slack off. So he's one of these types, huh? He's one of these types? Didn't matter anyway. Okay. All right. Um, Gengar probably can't do a whole lot to Steelix, right? I mean, I don't have great special defense. In power fire, must be. Yeah, this game's just over. Let him kill this. This one's just over. S Sucker Punch wouldn't have even worked there anyway. Huge, huge turn to Wake Pursuit. That was crazy. He is faster. I think I just need to Poison Jab for as much as I can. I just, I just probably lose. Oh, I can Sucker Punch, though. Oh, but he has extreme speed anyway. Smart. Smart cookie. But Aftermath! Aftermath! No one forget. No one remembers the Aftermath. Uh... I mean, Breelum's kind of good against both, except not really good against Bastion. Bastion. Pharaoh would be a decent U-turn on Slowking. God, I hate this Breedle move set, dude. It's so bad. I'd rather not do this because of rocks. You want to save the switches. Steel looks really bad if he brings in Slow King, though. Chimeco. Chimeco? I can't even heal if I do that. Whatever. Whatever, dude. I should have just uh, pursued it like I was originally gonna. Am I faster? I'm not even faster than you. I'm not even faster than you. Can't even toxic it. Energy ball won't do anything. At best, he lets me focus punch him. Oh, Metal Burst doesn't work like that! Metal Burst, you gotta hit him first! Oh no! Oh no! Well, Pharaoh's just dead anyway. What am I even gonna bring in on the Chimneco? It's Tropius, I guess? Whatever, we'll do it. Now, do I Toxic, or do I just Aerial Ace? It can have Thunder Wave sometimes. I have Decent Sp- oh. It has HP Fire. And it missed. HP Fire? Bruh. Was the Gengar HP Fire as well?
Absolute dog shit Breland. I was just talking to Toby in there. His team, those double HP fires were s silly. Were fucking silly. And of course the Gengar had HP fire as well when I switched on it. Just silly. Silly and stupid. But alright, he got that one. Alright, 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 he got that one, he got that one. Kind of some unfortunate stuff on my side there, because I had like... I had a... Uh, Steelix with Roar, but no entries. There was a number of things wrong there. I think I'm just supposed to rock slide though. It's quad times effective. Sure. Like, yes. Yes, I could have toxicked, but... I don't know if it really would have made a huge difference. Um, I don't think it would have anything super effective right until the sun is up. If it had HP, fire, or ice, or something. I feel like I can just toxic it, but what else do I have here? Cherim, I'm trying to think, usually, usually is like a sunny day, solar beaming, you know, that kind of thing. That kind of a thing. Ninjask wouldn't be so bad. I mean, unless he's doing fire stuff. Rass whistle, okay. All right, all right. That's fair, that's fair. Hmm. Let's probe a pass. <laughs> I see you. I see you and your spikes. Uh, I guess I should just power gem. Yeah. Super effective. Ugh, 1%? That's really shitty for me. That's really shitty for me. Well, fuck me. Well, that sucks. 1%? I mean, I guess he was gonna live anyway. Because it did 51% the first time and he was at 55 and then I got a, uh min max that made it what percent where if it just was the same he would have been at five or whatever <sighs> great 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 <sighs> he can't put me to sleep so there is that there is that all right all right look on the bright side Um, I also have two fast Pokemon that have moves that are super effective, and they're both faster, so that's kind of hype. Um, can't put me to sleep because of Cradilly. Might be like sub nasty plot. Uh, Dark Pulse Focus be Blast, or you know the sleep move, and then some of that stuff. I'm trying to think what, uh, what would I rather hold on to? I guess this dodges spike, so I should do this first. And it resists Focus Blast. Whereas Weavile is, like, not so great on against it. Obama snow. Okay. Let's think about this. Not. Oh, I guess it is weak to steel. He's not gonna earthquake because I'm flying. Weavile seems like a bad choice because it's choice banded. Dugon's not good here. Cradilly. If Awake Rock Slide would be not even that good. I feel like it's pretty much just gotta go. Wait. 
This isn't baton pass? Ha <laughs> ha. What? What? I mean, I do have the bug move, but that's still crazy. That's still crazy. That, uh... I just assumed it had baton pass. I literally just assumed it had baton pass. Miss Magius? Yeah, I shouldn't do that probably. And protecting doesn't do anything besides up my speed because of the ice. So then I should probably just switch to something. God, Miss Magius can also be really problematic sometimes. God, I really don't like... This is unfortunate that it is not Baton Pass. Do I go Dugong? Boosted Ice Beam, I guess. Or Encore, or Toxic It. Something like this. There's the nasty plot. I'm slower, right? Of course I am. I think I just hit Ice Beam for as much damage as possible and die. Because it is, of course, Thunderbolt. Yeah, it's just game. Right? Best thing I can do now is do this and then go for the dark move. Even if he switches out, this is pretty decent. On any of these things. I guess not on Vespaquin. So he's thinking about it. <sighs> nice. That's big for me. I assume he's gonna go Vespi. Because I am faster than Darkrai. Unless this Darkrai is... No, 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 it, it's not, it's not, it's not. I was like, wait, no, I already know that it's not, uh... It's not Scarfed or something crazy. The Cherim can get rid of... What? Oh, I'm fucking dumb. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, hmm. Interesting. Focus Blast Dark Pulse, huh? What am I gonna do with you? <laughs> you are... Bit of a problem. Right. My only strong move would be Ninja's X Scissor. If I got a Toxic on you, that would be good, but you're gonna be faster. I'm thinking you have the Sleep move. Problem is, like, both of my things that can Toxic you are probably gonna get one shot by a Focus Blast. would be my guess. Yep. Yep. But now, at least, I can fresh switch Ninjaskin. I can protect for more speed. Do I want that? I don't think I want that. I don't think that matters. I'm already faster. Just gonna do this. Okay. Now I switch to... Now I switch to what? I don't really want to switch to Weavile because Bug Move's going to be super effective. Um, I know Jirachi can wall it in terms of not... I guess Jirachi probably makes the most sense because Ice Punch, but also will resist. Or it'll be neutral the bug, I guess. There's the roost.
Okay. Okay, okay. Now I'm gonna do that. Serene Grace. Yeah, no, I know, but still. It's still, like, unlucky for you. Fades that. Sure. Ice Punch. Problem is Dark Rye Focus Blast, right? I think I gotta go for it, right? Oh, I think. Oh, there's. Oh, he flinched! He flinched! Wow. I mean, it makes sense. Better than Focus Blast, I guess. In case that happens. That was crazy. Now, Ninjask is still good here, because Bug's good on both. So I think I'm still in a good spot, but. I did not expect that flinch. Dark Pulse flinch. No reason for me to, like, protect, so. Oh, ice is gonna take it out. Ready? Boom, there's the ice. Oof. Keeping that Cradilia sleep. Ended up being big. Well, this is a start. I'm just not, I'm not trying to deal with this. I ain't trying to deal with this at all. I think... Altaria, probably? Just because Spore. And Resist X Scissor? Sweet. Sweet. Uh... I don't know if I want to necessarily Outrage, though. I don't know if I necessarily want to Outrage, but... I guess we'll... S Earthquake doesn't do anything, though. Alright, cool, he switched. Good. I'm faster, right? I am. I am. I am. This should kill. Look away from your nice. Did 55 the last time, so now this time does different. I, his switch there wasn't crazy, though, because Altaria can have Flamethrower or Fire Blast, I think. Now, I assume that he's might he might uh, T-wave me here, but... If I outrage him and he turns into a dragon, then he'll be a dragon type. So he kind of is forced to switch. Or it's going to be super effective because he'll be a dragon. But I think that I think that's reasonable. Oh, that's not great. Dragon dance? Yep. Yeah, that part is not as great. That part is not as great. Um, double Dragon Dance? Yeah. Okay, so my best chance is that he has, like, Waterfall Earthquake. Okay. Oh, shit. <laughs> Okay, he's crazy. Do you, are you like a rest talk? Or something? Oh my god, he actually is going the whole way. Oh, special defense drop! Oh god, he is. Okay, I was worried that might be the case. Once he did, started doing like more than that, I was like, uh oh, this could be a problem. I still resist though. I still resist though. And now with the special defense drop, I think I win this battle. I think even if you, I guess it depends on what your other move was. No, you didn't have one, so I think that does work out for me. I mean, he can rest right again, but the special defense drop's gonna catch up. I suppose if he got flinches on waterfalls or something like that, that could potentially uh, change it, but eventually I'm gonna get a spe at least one special defense drop, right?
He's committed in though, so I don't blame him for doing what he's doing. He was maybe think I'd be scared in Switch, which is pretty reasonable assumption. Um, okay, let's think here. This would be super effective, I guess. But I'm weak to rock. That's not good because of grass. This could be okay, but might get put to sleep. I think we do this then. Sleep misses. Now I'm faster, so I dodge it. Okay, at least he was smart about that. Smart about that, smart about that. Power whips. Sure. Damn, he does have a lot of... Fuck. No paras, huh? If I switch out and in, I think I technically stay alive. I don't know if that's worth it. I guess I'd be faster than both of these. Let's see, so he's power whipping. I would resist with Altaria. I don't do much though. Heracross would take some stuff. Heracross is good against both of these, I guess. Or it's not really only good against them. Okay, now I'm asleep. That's fun. Uh, okay. What's he gonna, he might have, he might be like swords dance and stuff, I guess. Let's think. I am gonna be faster. He could Earthquake, though. It might be, like, Sleep Powder, Power... Sleep Powder, Power Whip, Swords Dance, Earthquake. Could be a thing, I'm pretty sure. So, both of those attack moves not good on Rampardos. Hitmanly, the Earthquake wouldn't be good. I think that makes Altaria the right choice, then. Spirit Tomb, huh? Okay. All right. We'll just do this first. He is gonna call him lined up, okay. Don't call him. That does not do enough damage, all right. Wow. All right, we're in trouble. We are in trouble. Now, he probably has HP fighting, so I should just go for Stone Edge. Yep. I do be doing a lot of damage with that move. Also faster, so Fire Punch be doing a lot of damage. Woo! Really just needed to make sure that Stone Edge hit, and then I was good to go. It was faster than all three. Oof. That Spirit Tomb would have gotten scary, though. Nice. Cacturn Electrode. I know that Electrode can have in power ice. You can have taunt. You can have signal beam. Basically a bunch of things that don't look great against me here. So tempted to go like Nitto King, probably. Or Fortress would also be alright. Fortress is probably better, because it would also resist explosion. Doesn't do quite as well, I guess, against Thunderbolt, but... Yep, expected a taunt. Now I Gyro Ball. Alright. Fair enough, fair enough. Do I have anything good against Charizard? Not really. Not really. <sighs> I guess Intimidate if he's that, but most Charizards are not that. Okay, there's Crit. And he's Life Orb. So, we're, we lost. <laughs> Wait. Uh, no, Charizard's faster than me here. Faster than this. Super effective, super effective, super effective, super effective. Awesome. Awesome. I love when he has four... Four of the same type of move, not even counting his coverage, just literally fire blast. Do I even think Nidoking could take a hit? 
And even then, what would I do? None of my moves are good against it. So he might be like, Life Orb, Fire Blast, so Fire Blast, Roost, Air Slash, Dragon Pulse? Or maybe switch one of those for, uh, you know. <laughs> for uh, a hidden power of some kind. So all these sucker punches are basically pointless. I could Shadow Sneak for like a, a pitiful amount of damage. I really don't even know. Pitiful amount of damage. Air slash. It almost certainly is gonna have roost. If you roost right now, I'll forfeit probably. I guess literally that bad. I guess... Okay, all right, all right. Well, letting me get that stealth rock's gonna help with the Charizard quite a bit. So that counts for something, I guess. really not a whole lot I can do. If he's silly, then he would switch Charizard in on him some for some reason, but he's not. Now this is faster, I can Ice Shard. That's nice. Okay, you know I have Ice Shard. I feel like he could just wait for Delibird to be dead and then roost if he had it. I'm gonna rapid spin actually. I do this and then encore. Wait. Okay. That was stupid of me to do that in the first place, but. <laughs> I was like, wait, why did I just do that? Oh, yeah, we're super dead. That was a terrible switch anyway, because he has Sludge Bomb, which is literally just super effective. <laughs> so that was that was really dumb in the first place. Um, I don't know. I don't know. There's there's no point. Nothing really matters. I'm not gonna sucker punch though, because he might Swords Dance. He shouldn't Swords Dance because that's greedy, but. That's surprising. It's a little surprising. Um, there's the wheezing. I am fast. I guess I'm supposed to this. <laughs> I missed. Nice. Nice. Okay. So now what happens? Uh, what happens now? All right, do you have Magnet Rise or Hidden Power Fire? Probably Hidden Power Fire. He has Magnet Rise! <laughs> okay. All right. That goes forever, right?
That game was literally over though. He 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 said he made it like a bur like a goof on that one by uh, switching in the Zard. Only uh, only. Basically just should have lost in the first place, but yeah, it looks like the restart the, the server is gonna restart. Two. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. Um, yeah, that message came up. <laughs> it was f Toby. Even though like the Zard thing was a misplay and whatnot, like I basically just like yeah, I was supposed to lose that game anyway. You just made like a brain fart. Like I do that all the time, of course. So. No harm, no foul. That game was literally over. <laughs> like, it wasn't even a situation where, like, yeah, they're weak, but I, but it, they have a super effective move or something. It was just like, like no one can do any actual strong damage against it, because the uh, the Nidoking King was like Earthquake, Mega Horn Sucker Punch, Stealth Rock or something. The fortress obviously is not going to do anything unless it explodes, but if you hit it with any fire move, it'll just... Uh, Deli Bird. Aerial Ace, but you're faster. So the only thing I could have... That's why I went for the Stealth Rock so hard and whatnot, because I was like, look, my only chance is that... this Like, I sacrifice whatever I did to do a little smidge of damage to you, to get you close to 50. So that you then switch out... And then, uh, when you switch back in, I can sneak in somehow if I'm lucky, but you'd have to misplay. And it, that's what happened. It was just brain fart, so it was fine. It was fine. I don't know. Do you, I feel like this might be a good stopping point in general. I mean, we hit the four-hour mark stream-wise. We jumped into a couple of things. We did Tetris 99 event. That was smooth. I got a win in, like, five or six games and then did a little extra. Then we had, uh... Then we had some Picros and Chill. And then we did some nice wrap-up showdown with Toby, which was good. I feel like I'm in a good spot. I feel like this is a good spot to just end on a good note. We had some fun games. Some, some were kind of, uh, my team felt a little strong. Some your team a little strong. Some, there was one of the, we had like two games that were like really close, I think, though. That could have gone either way, very close. Uh, I think my highlight read of the day was doing the power whip with Tangrowth and you switch to Starmie in. I think that was probably my... The only thing that really stood out to me is like a, a read that worked out. Everything else was kind of whatever. I made a huge brain fart in that game when uh, I had literally said moments before like, oh, I can't go for Alligator because he because the Kyogre is faster and it probably has thunder. So I didn't. And then like 45 seconds later, I switch in for Alligator and just completely forget forget everything I said and uh, just get thundered and died. So that was kind of funny. Uh, yeah. Couple close ones there though. I have not done, I bet my rank, I bet my points are really low because de it degrades, right, over time. Oh no, it has me right at 1500, so it must, it probably degrades and then stops when it hits like a flat, like a certain number. So it degraded down to 1500 probably and stopped. I don't remember what I was at before though. I was probably somewhere in the middle, 1520 to 1560. Lazily today, too much thinking when you're playing for 1600 and kept playing with the same people. Hmm. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes playing a bunch is bad for sure. Either, either you get tired and so then you start making like little lapses in judgment or thinking or not taking the time to think through things slowly or you start overthinking. Especially if you play the same people in ranked and, or things like that.
The um, what was it? What did I have out first turn against the electrode? Forget. I already forget. Uh, whatever. Doesn't matter. So you're still at 16, right? Or maybe you're just below. I don't know. It doesn't really matter too much. But yeah, I think I think this will be probably a good spot to end for the evening. I don't know. I feel like I feel like if I do stuff, if I do more, I'll be tired and kind of just not fully there. So I think we 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 can end it here. We'll see what anyone else is up to. Um, new video came out today. New Unity video. I was pretty happy that I was able to crank that out yesterday. Because I knew I wasn't going to finish... Um, I knew I wasn't going to finish... The serial video if I tried to do it yesterday. So... I was glad I at least got something out this week. And... Um, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be... I don't think there's anyone I wanna raid. Yeah. And it's just... It's just the, the normal crew here anyway. So... Thanks for the games, Toby. Jumped through some games this evening. Sunday? I believe it's Sunday. I'll double check. But I'm almost 100% sure. Sunday is my 3,000th day of Puzzle and Dragons. So I will be doing an extra Puzzle and Dragon stream that Sunday. as Along with the normal Monday one. And, um... I got some... There'll be some reminiscing. Some, some chatter. Some discussion. As well as going through my box maybe to some degree and things like that so it'll it'll be chill um that'll be good tomorrow tomorrow if i did stream anything it would probably only be pokemon unite um if i was playing with the crew and felt like streaming i have done a couple i have done some games with them not streaming sometimes because i don't know it's not the most exciting thing anyway or just want to just zone out um yeah so sunday expect the 3000th Puzzle and Dragon stream. Monday will be regular one. Gonna work on the serial video tomorrow otherwise, as well as, um, obviously there's tons of videos in the pipeline, but other things like emotes and, you know, all, all the normal, all the normal things that I say I'm trying to work on. <laughs> uh, and then I, I guess we'll, yeah, there's some Unity games as well, so maybe that might be next Wednesday again, like this Wednesday, might do something similar. Might start up a new DS game. We'll see. We're feeling it out. But at least Sunday and Monday are pretty much planned. So I'll see you in Discord and wherever else. And uh, yeah. Have a good weekend if I don't see you. Good night.